I want to be there with them. Just think of your spices, count them. Have you put everything in there? Yeah, yeah. yeah? Yesterday, George said to me the dish was too sweet, so I just want to balance the flavour for the dish that I'm doing today. I'm using Matt's pantry and I'm making a Sri Lankan crab curry with coconut rice and a pineapple salad. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> It makes you feel enjoyable working in the kitchen. Like, it's only the cleaning up is the harder part. <laughs> but, like, cooking is something I really love to do. Um, I've got um, quite a big cookbook, so I've got about nearly 250. <laughs> I do get a lot of my inspiration from them. In my spare time, most of the time, I'll be in the kitchen. Oh, it looks so good. Six to seven hours um, cooking up storm. It's a privilege, I think, to be in MasterChef. So I will give all what I've got to cook really good food. I'm, I'm just uh, toasting the spices for the crab, um, for the curry. Quite smells good. It needs to be sweet, sour, spicy, zingy. Oh my God. Hey, that smells so good. Make George sweat. <laughs> oh my god, so much happening. <laughs> I'm so lucky to have this around my neck. But all the smells coming through this kitchen are amazing. It's obvious that everyone is cooking for their lives in the MasterChef kitchen. And though we got off to a rocky start, Sandeep's dish is looking and smelling amazing. D2, her curry smells are wafting through the kitchen and making me hungry. Right, time for the next dish. Matt. Okay. Oh, yum, that looks delicious. All right, boys. Oh, wow, we go. Oh, oh, hey. Did you make that yourself? <laughs> <laughs> smells like something I made. <laughs> so we have a crab curry with coconut rice and a side of acha. Bibs, bring us some chairs. <laughs> Who made this? Who made this? Bang. It's got my dirty little finger bridge all over it. Well done. I can't believe it. It feels so good to get that apron. And I can't wait to cook in the MasterChef kitchen. It's just a dream come true. <laughs> Dee, you're next. That is a weighty plate of food, isn't it? I'm really proud that I've made it so close to my mum's curry. So I hope the judges will like it. Wow, Dee, that's some serious cooking. Uh -huh. What have you cooked? I made my mum's chicken curry, dal, and um, coconut sambo with uh, coconut roti. You made your mum proud? I think so. That looks amazing. lovely about every single one of those elements on there is they've all got an identity. You know, you get that coconut, chilli, lime, this dal with the flavour of curry leaf and this beautiful curry, these coconut roti. Thanks, Gary. That dish we will remember for a long time. Thanks, Gary. Brilliant stuff, Dee. Thank you so much. And that's the long version. The short version, delicious. Thank you. Yeah. 
<laughs> really stoked. I think I've made my mum proud. But I think she still thinks her one is better. <laughs>